Okay, right, this is SpartanLeathers.com. Uh, it's a, a live e-commerce website using the Zencar open, soft, uh, open source software. Uh, that's a, 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 an offshoot of OS Commerce, well used. And this site has got a lot of problems that OS Commerce and Zencar uh, e-commerce sites have. What we're going to do is live online over several weeks and several videos, we're going to show you how we're going to take this website's problems and transform it into a money-making machine. Uh, it's going to be quite simple. You don't have to be a rocket scientist to follow what I'm going to do. Very simple problems here, so just follow along what we're doing and hopefully you can transform your website just like we're going to do. So, Spartan Leathers. Obviously, as you can see, they sell motorcycle leathers. Now, the site's already got traffic. It's well cached in Google, uh, but it's not performing. Uh, it's showing up for the wrong keywords, uh, and I can tell that because I've had a look inside its sitemaps. Uh, and it's got a low percentage uh, of, of uh, natural uh, listings inside the search engine. In other words, when you're typing in keywords uh, and look at the analytics, uh, the site uh, from its natural listings inside analytics doesn't have a big percentage of people coming in from the search engine themselves. So if we could actually cure that problem, then we're going to get more search traffic, which is, is qualified traffic, which means that they are looking for what this site sells. And so by definition, there's no reason why we can't sell uh, more products. I've had a look across the website and searched out Spartan Leathers. Uh, I, I can see that on the forums of people who are riding motorbikes, that the well-respected company, so there's nothing wrong with the product itself. The problem is, is that the website's not showing. It's as simple as that. So all I've got to do is make sure that we can get this to show for, say, some search terms like motorcycle leathers or motorcycle racing suits. And if we can do that by structuring the content of the site, then quite simply, it must take more money. I mean, it is really that simple. So what I want to do is, if I just show you inside the source of the file, so just bring up that, all I've done there is just click on view source. You can see at the top here, what's making it dead easy for us, that means that we can go to work straight away, is that the site's got Google uh, sitemaps added to it already. And then, down at the bottom of the page, if I can just get that there, I'm just going to have to move that up you can see here that it's got Google Analytics too so with Google Analytics and Google sitemaps we know that we can track inside Google exactly what Google can see about this site which makes it very easy for me to identify what the site's problems are and quite simply some of these can be seen I'll just move this back down into the screen again that the site has got some title tags so it's using those, that's good. And it's also got some description tags. So a lot of the work that we're going to be doing is going to be revolving just around these two tags because Google places a great importance on these two tags. Now I appreciate that it doesn't use the description tag inside it for its search engine rankings, but it does use them for the snippet and that's important once Google's found the site and shows it in its search results so that you know what you're looking at. So, we'll get rid of that. And that is that, that really is, is the overview of what we're going to do. And from this next video on, we're going to start and show you how we're going to fix this.